Judging Distances by Henry Reid. Not only how far away, but the way that you say it is very important. Perhaps you may never get the knack of judging a distance, but at least you know how to report on a landscape. The central sector, the right of the arc and that, which we had last Tuesday. And at least you know that maps are of time, not place, so far as the army happens to be concerned. The reason being is one which need not delay us. Again you know that there are three kinds of tree, three only, the fir and the poplar and those which have bushy tops to you. And lastly, that things only seem to be things. A barn is not called a barn, to put it more plainly, or a field in the distance where sheep may be safely grazing. You must never be over sure. You must say when reporting at five o'clock in the central sector is a dozen of what appear to be animals. Whatever you do, don't call the bleeders sheep. I'm sure that's quite clear, and suppose, for the sake of example, the one at the end, asleep, endeavours to tell us what he sees over there to the west and how far away, after first having come to attention. There to the west, on the fields of summer, the sun and shadows bestow vestments of purple and gold. The still white dwellings are like a mirage in the heat, and under the swaying elms a man and a woman lie gently together. Which is perhaps only to say that there is a row of houses to the left of the ark, and that under some poplars a pair of what appear to be humans appear to be loving. Well that, for an answer, is what we rightly call moderately satisfactory, only the reason being is that two things have been omitted, and those are very important. The human beings now, in what direction are they and how far away, would you say? And do not forget there may be dead ground in between. There may be dead ground in between and I may not have got the knack of judging a distance. I will only venture a guess that perhaps between me and the apparent lovers, who incidentally appear now to have finished, at seven o'clock from the houses is roughly a distance of about one year and a half. 